Hi everybody, here is a really tricky question on externalities and welfare loss. It's not an easy question, but do have a go and uh, come back to me and we'll go through the correct answer and the reasoning. So here's our question. It contains an analysis diagram. The diagram shows the marginal private cost, MPC, and the marginal social cost, MSC, of a good, and its marginal social benefit. Which area measures the net social benefits if output OQ is produced? Now, a clue here. OQ is the private optimum where private costs and benefits are optimised. But what's the net social benefit of that level of output? Have a go. I'll be back in a few seconds with the right answer and the all-important explanation. So what did you put for this question? The net social benefit of output OQ is... It's B, X minus Y. Let's think about it from the point of view of accumulating social benefit. So social benefit is accumulating, if you like, a bit like profit or welfare, but social welfare is accumulating as long as the social benefit at the margin is greater than the social cost. And if we take, for example, this area here, from this range of output, the social benefit curve is greater than the social cost curve. So therefore, total social benefit is rising up to that point. But beyond that output, in other words, the area shaded Y, in that situation, marginal social cost is now higher than marginal social benefit. So in that sense, social welfare in net terms would be falling. So social benefit rising in net terms in area X, but falling in area Y until we reach the output OQ. Therefore, the net social benefit is X minus Y. Now, the crucial bit is that the intersection between social cost and social benefit gives us the social optimum, which is to the left of Q. I'm going to use my cursor here to show it. It's there. That's the social optimum. Of course, if we go beyond it to output Q, we suffer a deadweight loss of social welfare equal to the area Y. But the question isn't about the deadweight loss, the question is about the net social benefit. So it's therefore X minus area Y. And that's how to answer this question.